Agriculture has always been a field which requires a lot of hard work and human supervision to complete even the smallest of tasks. It also requires a skilled eye such as being able to recognize when crops are ready to be picked, or recognizing diseases in crops early, or even detecting insects which can cause harm to certain crops. So it's safe to say that a lot of work is needed to increase productivity in this field. But this is where AI comes in. In 2050, the world's population will increase from 7.3 billion to 9.7 billion people on the planet, meaning food production must increase by a whopping 70%. The only way this can be achieved is through the help of AI. Let's take a look at how AI is being incorporated in agriculture to tackle these problems. Starting with in-field monitoring with computer vision, AI can be used to monitor the health and progress of crops in field. Pests are a major issue in agriculture, being one of the main sources of reduction in crops. Pests cause two problems in agriculture. The first is by causing damaging crops in food production. The second is indirect damage. Some insects are able to transmit bacterial, viral, or fungal infection to a crop which can spread quite rapidly, resulting in major losses. This is where AI comes in. With the use of computer vision through drones, we are able to identify harmful pests in crops. Once identified, the drone will proceed to spray the crop with pesticides. With the use of computer vision, farmers will also be able to get notified when a disease is spotted. Early detection of diseases reduces the chance of spread and ensures better quality control. Computer vision is also used to check on crop readiness as well as check up on livestock. Livestock can be monitored 24-7 and checked for sicknesses or diseases, which can help farmers take action immediately when spotted. Computer vision can also be applied to the problem of soil diagnosis. Startups such as PEAT have developed an algorithm that can identify the strength and wellness of soil. The goal is to reduce the chances of growing underdeveloped crops while optimizing the potential for healthy crop production. Another application of AI in agriculture is predictive analytics. The current state of agriculture involves a lot of guesswork with farmers applying water and pesticides uniformly to crops. The issue with this is there may be some plants in need of pesticides or water. Other plants will not benefit from the additional water or pesticides. This causes a massive waste in both water and pesticides. But with the help of data-driven agriculture, farmers are able to utilize precision farming, which detects and identifies crops that require water or pesticides and provide it only to the plants that are in need of it. This asubstantially method will substantially reduce cost and wastage of water and pesticides. With the use of big data, we are able to use it as actionable insights helping farmers make decisions in order to improve sustainability, efficiency, reduce costs, and increase profitability. This consists of collecting data from soil sensors, GPS-equipped tractors, and other external sources such as local weather data. This allows farmers to drastically increase productivity while decreasing manpower. Autonomous Robots one of AI's major applications in agriculture is autonomous robots. Autonomous robots help increase productivity while allowing farmers to focus on more important aspects. Harvesting and picking is one of the most popular robotic applications in agriculture due to the accuracy and speed that robots can achieve to improve the size of yields and reduce waste from crops being left in the field. With the use of autonomous robots combined with computer vision, the machine will be able to identify the ripeness of the crops and pick based on a few merits such as readiness, disease-free, and many more criteria. So there you have it. It's safe to say that AI's applications in agriculture have come a long way and be needed to feed the world's growing population. Thanks for watching, and as always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. See you next time.